I'm going to turn this into this. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to show you how you can arrange all these polythene bags in your home to look even more amazing. You want to reduce the clutter in the home and actually improve the kind of storage that you have in your home. We're going to start with a bigger triangle that looks like that. So you want to get your polythene bag, make sure you even it out, make it look nice, arrange all the corners. And then you want to fold it once like that evenly and then you want to start with a right angled triangle so that you see that is a right angled triangle and then you go with the floor okay like that and you keep you know flattening it out to remove any kind of air so once you reach this stage you want to take this corner here and you want to fold it once okay so you see that in here there is a bit of space where you can tuck it in so you want to tuck it in in there tuck it all in so that it's neat Okay, tuck it in like that. Now you don't have to be so perfect, but you want to make sure that it's folded neatly and you can store it away. That is the first triangle. Light bulb moment, Lisa. Did you know that a giraffe's tongue can grow to up to half a meter long? Uh, it could literally lick away all your sorrows. <laughs> sorrow free the second type of triangle and we want to make the smaller size which is this so you do the same you repeat the process you want to organize your polythene in a very organized way clear out all the edges like we did in the first step okay remove any air Flatten it out and then you make the first even shape and then you want to fold it another time. So that's the difference there. With the bigger one, you fold once. With the smaller one, you fold twice. And then you go in with your right angle triangle again, the smaller one, and then you keep moving while removing all the air, you know, just making it as neat as you can. Okay. okay, keep removing any air that comes there. Keep organizing as neatly as possible. We've reached the end. You want to fold it there. And then you want to tuck it in. Okay, make it as neat as you can. All right. And we have a beautiful triangle right there. So the shapes will vary according to the size of your polythene bag. Then you can store them even much better in a box or wherever you want to keep them. That is my tip for you today.